And Gene Steratore, he's on TV, he lives in his in his uh, triple-wide, luxurious trailer in the trailer park capital of the world, Washington, PA, where he's king with his big janitorial supply service. I, I don't know why I said all that. I think Gene does a good job, but he was a good ref. But I just like the idea that he's the king of Washington, PA, because he is absolutely, 100%, the king of Washington, PA. Is the league's credibility being eroded? I hear words like rigged being used, and I know it's not. I know it's not, but but I, I still hear those words, and again, that can't be good. Well, it isn't good, and you know, for to even address something as ludicrous as that would 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 be giving it too much attention as far as I'm concerned, Mark. But what does occur, and unfortunately, officials are very aware of it. You know, when we ended up in the scenario where you know, how many times we replayed the third down play or, you know, the, the, the officials' inability to shut that play down before it took place and, uh, you know, having administration errors or, lack, you know, lapses in focus. Once those things occur in any game, especially on that stage, then inevitably what's going to happen is any other close call throughout the course of that game uh, you know, this officiating crew realizes that as well. Like, you're not going to get any love on any other close play the rest of the day because you've kind of lost this credibility because of your inability to administer something, you know, uh, on the downtime, basically, right? So when you have some lapses like that, uh, and rightly so, and officials get that, you know, it's a, so those things tend to grow momentum. And if you have these types of situations occur, every other week, every week, and even just one game, uh, then you end up in, uh, you know, into a very difficult situation. And unfortunately, there's been some weeks like that in the NFL. And, and as you just said, when you're on the stage of the championship and have something like that break down, uh, there's an awful lot of downtime here to talk about all of that. And you want this aspect of the, of the game to come to kind of go away and let us all get prepared for the Super Bowl and the two teams that are about to, uh, you know, to get on this field uh, in, a, in a week from Sunday. 